All right, um, as promised, trying to do a quick tutorial on building a recipe uh, in MyFitnessPal. All right, opening the app, we'll click over here and go to Recipes, Meals, and Food. Then I'm going to create a new recipe down here at the bottom. All right, you can add from the web. I've never tried doing that. Um, I'm not sure how that functionality works. I probably should try it, but I'm just gonna add ingredients manually. I'm going to name the the uh, sorry the recipe. These were banana protein muffins and servings. I had a, a double batch, so I made twenty four uh, muffins. I'll get more into serving size later. Um, this is easy because of course I was just filling up muffin tins, so I just did essentially twenty four even. Um, even pours into the muffin tins, um, but uh, you, you can, there's different methods of doing it if you're doing like crock pot meals and that sort of thing, but for now we'll go with uh, 24 servings. Um, then up here in the top right corner, we're gonna hit next and add ingredients. All right, so we're gonna click on the search at the top of the screen and I do like cups of, sorry, not cups of, with flour, white. This ingredient called for two cups of flour. And um, I'm probably going to edit this video so that the uh, entering of ingredients here speeds up so you don't have to watch me for five minutes entering entering in different ingredients. Uh, I'll probably stop talking here too. Okay, so that's all the ingredients now in my recipe. I'm gonna hit save. So um, we can see here that each muffin now has 101 calories, 13.6 grams of carbs, 2.1 grams of fat, and eight grams of protein. I'm gonna add it to my diary. And then up in the right-hand corner, just hit the click check mark. So now it's added to my uh, diary for today. And I actually had three of these this morning. So there we go, 24 grams of protein, 6 grams of fat, and 40 grams of carbs. But that's how you add it to the uh, to your um, kind of like saved recipes. So now let's say I'm going to have, um, sorry, let's go say that I'm going to have some tomorrow or for lunch or something like that. Go to add food and then click over here. We can click on recipes and we'll see that I have my banana protein muffins saved here as well as a couple others that I've made in the past. And it's just an easy way, if, especially if it's something that you make on a regular basis. Um, you can just build the foods up in your app over time and um, makes it real easy to add. All right.